Okay guys, so today I'm bringing you a just been shopping it in Manchester so I thought I'd film what I got today and some of my favourites so it's a mixed video of what I've bought today um, recently purchased and favourites so I hope you enjoy well, I'll start off with my favourites right so some of the things I have mentioned in other videos whilst using them like makeup tutorials, hair tutorials all that jazz so the first thing is the Aveeno moisturiser is literally my favourite moisturiser of all time like I really do need to try out another new moisturisers but so far this one is doing exactly what it says and it's keeping my skin moisturised. Also another moisturiser I, I, I have been loving when my skin's been quite dry so I put it on at night and in the morning if my skin's still really dry uh, but I only have to use it a couple of times and then that's it. But I don't know how to say it. Dipro Base Cream. It's just like a really thick um, moisturiser for like dry skin, eczema, anything like that. So I really do love that. I got that from the doctors. So, so it's so big. Um, so I only use that every so often, but I really do enjoy it. But again, the Aveeno cream, I take it, it's in my car, it's in my bag, it's in my house. Um, it's in my bedroom, it's in my dressing room, it's just everywhere because I love it so much. It's just, just what it says. I like the texture of it as well. It's not like because I don't like I don't like product on my body. Um, like I don't like putting moisturiser on my body. Like I don't like putting tan on my body. Everything has to be covered up if I'm putting something on my body because I don't like my skin touching. Like you know if you put your arm together. Um, anyway, the next thing that um, is a favourite of of all time literally my favorite makeup remover ever and i've been trying to find something that like can compare to it or as easy as this but i need to find something so it's the yoski i have mentioned this before and all that but legit guys oh my god i love this like if yoski if you have this let me know because i can't find it anywhere um it's just the best makeup remover ever like it's for face and eyes um i have used it on my eyes before but then i started using the express two in one um makeup remover so i just use this to take all makeup off and then i use something else to take my eye makeup off but this is like my favorite makeup remover ever like i love it so much and i've got the gel one as well and that's my favorite too but this is my favorite of all time because it's just it just takes all my makeup off like I can wipe my face with a baby wipe and there's nothing there and usually like you'll take all your makeup off with some product and then you've still got makeup there so I just love it it's the best and your skin if you've got any please contact me because I need some more and I'm too scared to use the rest of it um the next thing is a red tea toner so this just gently cleanses and tones your face, um, leaving your face nice and soft and fresh and healthy and looking glowy. Um, I really do love this. I mean, I don't use it every night, but I use it before, um, either before I'm going to bed, after I've done all my skincare or before I'm putting makeup on. I just, it just feels really fresh and makes my face feel nice and moisturised and I don't have to constantly keep touching my face to make sure it's like got some moisture in it. I just love it I just I mean it's it was I think it was six pound and I, I don't know how much it is usually I'll leave it in the description box below anyway so um, the next thing I've mentioned a dozen times I'm sorry but I'm gonna have to mention it again um, is the factor heat defense do I have to say anymore do I have to say anymore it smells amazing does its job keeps my hair nice and healthy it makes my hair soft, it makes my hair straight, it makes my hair nice and curly, it just keeps it how it should be. It is amazing. And I will never ever change it until I get another one. I mean, I'm going to try the Argan one, um, but I need to get hold of that. But I'm definitely going to purchase this again, so I love it. So going on to, oh wait I've got one more. 
so another thing that I have been absolutely loving oh my god eyelashes are my thing like I wear eyelashes every single day no matter where, where I'm going if I've not got any makeup on then I won't wear any but I've got some on today and I, I just wear them constantly and the Ilo eyelashes are my favourite I've not found it, like any eyelashes that compare to these but um, I just love them. These are the 035 and they're like a really natural finish so I wear, the, I wear these every day to work and wherever I'm going, if I'm going out for dinner or anything like that, I just wear them constantly and I really want some of the wispy ones, I really want, oh, I want to try the Chanix O's, I want to try, oh my god, I want to try them all. <laughs> um, the next thing is the Good Things blemish control gel mask it's three in one i don't know how to say it so it's anti anti blemish oil clearing and sal it's i've not tried this yet but i've had it for i really do want to try it and i'm probably going to try it i might try it tonight it smells good summer fruits summer fruit extract mango and another word i can't pronounce so when I try this out guys, I'm probably going to brag about it or I'm not going to talk about it at all. So I'll let you know because I love face masks. Another thing that I've had for a while is from Lush and I love Lush. I mean, I don't part, I don't go mad in it or anything. I'm, I've had this for quite a while and my lips have been getting pretty dry recently. So because it's getting cold, I want to keep them moisturised and a lot of moisturisers don't moisturise your lips. They keep them soft. But they don't like get everything off so this is the bubblegum lip scrub you, so it's like um you probably can't see it because of the light it's like a sugar and it's so it's like you just i usually put this on if i'm extremely dry then i'll just put this on and you just put a little bit on your finger and then you just like basically exfoliate your lips so i really do love that i think it was only like so a repurchase of mine are the cotton wool oval pads. So I've got two packs because I go through these like crazy. Um, the last time I actually used these was when I was using the Yoskin makeup remover. Um, and obviously I'm not using it anymore because I don't want to use it anymore. I really need some more. Um, and you get 50 pads on each pack. So th these were £1.60 I got them from Superdrug today. Um, and I just really love them. They do as you know they just take your makeup off um you don't have to use loads of them either so i do love those another repurchase of mine is something that i talked in something i talked about in my product empties was the garnier 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 skin naturals express 2 in 1 eye and makeup remover and it looks like this when it's full and it looks really cool it's like jiggling around um, yeah, it was £2.19 actually. I think I said it was £3 something in my other video, but it was £2.19. So, you just shake it up. And then it ends up looking like that. Um, don't worry, it goes back to the oily. It goes back to the oily one because I like it like that. <laughs> um, I love this. It's just it's really, really good for getting all my eye makeup off and mascara because I hate having mascara on my eyes when I've got no makeup on. So I do love this and I will continue repurchasing it until I find something that is equivalent to it. Yeah, I do love this. So I used to use these two together. So I'd use this one to take my makeup off and then this one to take my eye makeup off. And I always do that no matter what I'm doing. If I'm using baby wipes to take my makeup off, uh, makeup wipes, any different cleansers or wash my face in the shower I always take my eye makeup off with this first or, or after I just always use take my eye makeup off I never use anything else with a cotton pad um, so I've got four oh no I've got one more thing so this is a new purchase of mine is the like the dupe for a tangle teaser um, and I got this from TK Maxx I like that it's got a little handle but I'm not going to brush my hair now because it's curly. Um, but I do get what they mean by like being like all different shape bristles. And it does brush your hair 
a lot easier, a lot quicker, a lot faster, a lot nicer. And especially if you've got curly hair like mine, then you need something to brush through your hair nice and soft. So I do love using it. I've not used it while my hair's wet yet, so that's something I need to try, but I love using it on a day-to-day -day basis. I'm probably going to get another one to put in my bag, but um, so yeah, I do really love this. And if you haven't tried them out, then you need to get one if you've got big crazy hair. Right, so four new purchases from today are... Right, so the first thing we got was the Garnier Skin Naturals My, my cellar. Do you know what? Why do I even... Why do I try pronouncing things? Um, it's a cleansing water and I've seen Lauren Curtis use this in her video. Um, I'm sure I've seen someone else use it as well, but... Um, this just is to try and compare to this and I'm sure it won't but I'm just gonna have to try it so it's a cleansing water removes makeup and cleanses and soothes no rinsing face eyes lips no perfume so basically it just takes all your makeup off and um, you don't have to take it off with water you just use, literally use this with a cotton pad or anything that you want to take your makeup off with a flannel or anything um, you don't have to shake it or anything it's just like it's basically like water, um, so you don't have to, it's not like irritating your skin or anything because it's just like water. So I'm yet to try that, I'll let you guys know when I've tried it, if I do like it and if I don't, and I'll let you know in the comments box or the description box, or I'll let you know on Twitter or Instagram or Facebook. So follow me on those guys and I'll link them all here. So I'm excited to use that. The next thing is the three last things I'm trying to make up and I've been recently ever since <coughs> I've been really enjoying doing makeup tutorials recently um, and I thought I need something to because I've been uploading like three four times a week so I do a vlog a tutorial a hair tutorial a makeup tutorial whatever you guys want to see you need to let me know in the comments box below so then you can give me some crazy little ideas of yours so so then I know what you want so the first thing I got was the L'Oreal Paris Infallible 24 hour stay fresh foundation yes Rosie I got it I, you told me I needed to get it and I got it I got it so I'm really really excited to use this I can't wait to use it I'm probably gonna do a make makeup tutorial after this so um, I'm gonna probably use this but I'm so excited to use it, Rose said I'm going to love it and I really hope I do. And I got mine in the shade 200 Golden Sand. Um, I'm not sure, I didn't, I'm not really good with shades and that so um, yeah I got that and that was 9 and I hope I really do like it because I'll go back and I'll get it in because this is like medium tan and medium, this is like in between tan and pale. So I got it in between that because when I tan, I like using my special foundations for when I tan. Just like, I should have actually mentioned this in this further. So it's the Fall Perfection shade 53. And I've been absolutely loving this again. They don't actually have it. I think it's online maybe. I think you can get it on eBay or Amazon. So that was just another favourite for me. You guys, um, I love it. It looks flawless on my skin. I'm wearing it now. Obviously, it's worn off now, but it's what looks worn off a bit. But still looks quite sheer. I'm gonna. I've got a video to go up, so that will go up before this. Um. So I'll link it in this description box when I do upload that. But back to this. I can't wait to use it. Let's read what it's what it's all about. So, got 24 hour just applied finish. Flawless complexion, no transfer, no visible imp imperfections, no visible shine, no dry out, no mask effect. Sounds pretty perfect to me. So I'll let you guys know when I've tried that too. And I'll probably end up doing a makeup tutorial on it. The next thing I got was the Sleek 
makeup bare skin foundation natural feel liquid foundation light coverage i've been recently liking light coverage i used to be like one of the people that really loved full coverage but now i feel like some of them look really cakey and feel really heavy so um i just thought i'd try this out and the shade is shell shell maybe um so I'm excited to use that. I don't know how it'll be. It wasn't expensive, but I think it was like seven pounds or something like that. So I'm excited to use that. This moisturising formula events out skin tone and texture, conceals imperfections and nourishes skin, flawless natural look, fresh, breathable, bare, barely there feel, um, radiant complexion. So I'm excited to use that. And the last thing I got was the Sleek Makeup Eye Divine Ultra Matte Bright Palette. I'm really excited to use this because um, I have no coloured eyeshadows so I was like I need to experiment like Christmas looks, makeup looks, um, party looks, all sorts of looks. I need to get loads of palettes so then I can... So this palette is extremely bright, so if you've got sensitive eyes guys, put some sunglasses on or something. So it's this. So I'll just take a brush somewhere. It gets this light, you get this little sponge brush with it which I won't use. So they're the colours, and you see they're not coming up very bright on here, but in colour, in person sorry, they are very very bright. So let me read the shade. So I've got so the top shade we have we've got chill we've got pout we've got sugar light we've got dragonfly pucker bam pow creep floss strike bolt and cricket so i'm extremely excited to use these um, especially for like really fancy makeup, I really want to like experiment a lot more with makeup, neutral look. <laughs> so I'm excited to use that. Um, I think it'll be good for a lot of tutorials. Um, so yeah. Right, so I think that's it for this video guys. I really do hope you enjoyed my favourite slash new purchases and repurchases video and if you did make sure you give it a big thumbs up and if you enjoy seeing my videos then subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in my next video bye